this is a picture of our lens tool. This is what we use to rate Serve City. As you can see, most of the money they made went to their actual cause and very little went to compensation, which is good. They also scored high in part two with a high accountability because they had a very good informational website that tells you all about the people that work there. You can get a hold of them easy. They respond quickly. It's very good. They also scored high with the purpose because they have, well, if you go to their website and you go to the purpose, there's a lot of information about why they do what they do. And it's also very good. And they also did good in validation because they have won magnified giving before, which just further validates them as a good charity. Hi, my name is Linda Kimball, and I'm the executive director here at Serve City in Hamilton, Ohio. We're a faith-based organization that is meant to show the hands and feet of Jesus um, in a hurting community. Our focus of service is on the homeless. We have an emergency homeless shelter that houses up to 52 people and four different apartment buildings with transitional housing that houses another 78 people that are coming out of homelessness. Our other major area of service is a food pantry. We serve roughly between six and 800 families a month in our food pantry. These are people that are at or below 150% of the poverty level, and they just need extra help feeding their families. This time of year is very busy for us. We have not only the holidays coming up, so a lot of people are in need of more food, but we also have a lot of volunteers coming in, which we really appreciate. If you'd like to support us, we always can use help here. And, and that's a big thing that we emphasize. We have over 70 different churches that bring in meals every night to feed the homeless. We also have a great deal of churches and community people that come in to help volunteer in our food pantry to help walk people through and make good, responsible choices in how they eat. And we can always use your help with that. We also always accept cash donations or donations of gently used clothing, household items, and anything basically that you would need if you're starting a new home. Since a lot of our people who come to us have lost everything, they pretty much need anything that you would have to offer. We also, for the shelter, always need new or gently used towels, sheets, all those types of things. Those are all good, practical, sometimes easy ways that you can support what we do here. We're located at 622 East Avenue. I'm asked a lot when we're open. We're always open because the people that live here, we're open 24 hours a day. So it's a little easier if you come in before 11 o'clock at night, but we are always here and ready to work with you to help serve the community. Thank you.